Let's see what that works. Now here it goes. A couple of people were asking about the the TV lift too. Well, the the mechanism shown in the video isn't using this. This is a more simple method. I just had to get the ball rolling because I'm I'm making a cinema at the minute and I have two children and they were torturing me. So here it goes anyway. Um, this is up. Simple. When you want your PC, you just lift it. When you want to watch your cinema and you want the PC out of the road, it just drops. Say it's something to buy motors, actuators, building a frame, etc. That I would have had to do using the TV lift mechanism shown in a previous video. There you go. Oh. There. I have these stays as well that I, I haven't fitted them yet, but I'm in the process of fitting them. They're, they go up fairly easy, but they've got a bit of friction, which can be adjusted for the way down. So, sort of like a soft close mechanism, you know, if you get them. So, this is, up the, this is the center speaker for the surround sound. I just bought that on because I couldn't think of anywhere else to put it. And this is the cabinet inside, this is where all the, the media and the video equipment and games, consoles, etc. go on here. And a uh, bit of storage for DVDs and videos, etc. A couple of drawers here, I dare say. Why can I not get on that one? Oh, I, I closed that door, so it was... Um, Stabby knocking it and the banging on the table there. So that's it, but I'll show you a wee closer look here. Show you how simple it is. It's not actually finished, there's a couple of wee finer details to do at the minute. But um, it's just basic hinges. And uh, I'll show you now. This just moves on the hinge. This is attached to the top, obviously. I'll show you how that's done. That's done. You, you can't really see it because it's well masked, but there's four holes here. But I've, I've overfilled them with like a soft filler and just finished it with stain and a bit of varnish. And if the monitor ever has to come out in the future, all I have to do is dig out the four wee holes and then sand it down and refinish it and put a new monitor in but as you can see there, there's no wasted space on it the sides has been used as well for space and uh, this side as well over here you know so that's basically it there I'll just set this down now Give you another look at the lift mechanism to show you. The thing I like about it is a lot of rooms you go under, you see the PC and the PC ticks over the room. Whereas with this here, you have your PC and then when you don't want it, that's it, out of the road. No motors, no mechanisms, nothing to go wrong. Just a pair of simple hinges. That's it. I hope it was worth the wit.